Hello Peter, welcome back to Berlin after such a long time. How are you doing and briefly tell us who you are and what you're doing in Germany. My name is Peter Walaku, I come from Nigeria. I had um, studied my bachelor in Nigeria and I was looking for forward to furthering my education and I decided to come to Germany. Um, I got contact with Eurasia Institute and they helped me to secure an admission in the Technical University of Klaustal and I've been there and I'm studying in my third semester right now. Great, and how did you come to the decision of studying in Germany? As a Nigerian from an English speaking country, you could easily study in the UK or in USA or in Canada. Why German? Yes, that's a very interesting question because um, most Nigerians tend to go to the UK or the United States to study, but for me it was a very um, nice situation that I just thought about learning a foreign language. It was also a motivation for me that I had to learn a foreign language and many people see that as a disadvantage, but for me I see that as a very big advantage because right now I also have the possibility or the opportunity to communicate freely when I'm in countries like Austria, Switzerland or Belgium and other Dutch speaking countries. Great. And tell us about the process. How did it uh, start the first day you come to Eurasia and then now you're at the university? How did it happen? Yeah, well, I came to Germany on the 3rd of March 2014. Um, it was a very interesting day. I, I just got from the airport. Um, Eurasia Institute had already organized the taxi for me and the taxi driver took me home and helped me get my things in my room and the next day I had to find my way to school. It was, it was interesting. I had to ask people on the streets like for directions and they gave me the German people are nice and um, when I go to school I had to learn German for a couple of months but Right now, I can speak German fluently, at least people tell me, but um, it was a very interesting process and not just for my education, but also for my personality. I think I've developed a lot since I, I've been in Germany. I have a lot more experience in life. Well, I can personally testify that you speak fluent German. Uh, how, how much effort did it cost? How, what did you do in order to come to this level? Um, well, um, Someone has to work hard, of course, but I think the most important thing is um, the interest. Um, when, when someone has interest in learning a new language, then it's a bit easier because language is not like mathematics that you just stay and learn the formulas, but you just have to have interest and also be nice and talk to people even outside your school. Great. And now you're studying at the Technical University of Klaustad. Yeah. Um, did you... Was this your first choice or would you have wished to study somewhere else or in Berlin? What are the advantages of studying in this place where you are now? Um, well, before I came to Germany, um, the Eurasia Institute had already um, secured an admission for me because I sent in my documents um, in the Technical University of Klostal and I already had that so it was like my first choice. But when I got to Berlin, I also tried to um, to switch over because I found Berlin very interesting and nice and very international but at the same time now that I'm studying in Klostal I'm still very satisfied because um, I have a very wonderful education right now and a wonderful study and also because I'm living in a small state or a small town I have the opportunity to really meet Germans and really integrate and get to know the German culture very well. Great and what are you studying exactly? I'm studying geo-environmental engineering and that's a combination of environmental engineering and geology, uh, a little bit of civil engineering. Um, I studied civil engineering in my bachelor when I was in Nigeria, but right now it's like I'm going deeper in the civil engineering field and it has a lot to do with the ground and the soil. So I'm studying things about the soil and how to build structures that are stable. What does it take to live and study in Germany? Um, well, in Germany, the, the, the university is almost free of charge. You only just pay small fees for each semester. 
and in this fees um, you also have your transportation included which is very very cheap in comparison with countries like England or the USA or Australia but um, in Germany you don't pay much for school you don't even pay any school fees you just pay like dues for the semester and then you just have to take care of your your own personal demands like feeding accommodation and and every other thing having fun and relaxation so how do you finance your studies or your stay the living expenses um, well I was very lucky at the beginning I had to work um, beside my university um, that's the standard practice, but that wasn't so good for me. So I tried to get a scholarship, but I, w I got lucky. And right now I have a scholarship with a Conrad Adenauer Stiftung. It's like an organization that supports um, intelligent people, or I wouldn't classify myself as so intelligent, but just good students that have a dream and have a motivation to, to achieve something in life. Great. So it's also a possibility for foreign students to get a scholarship in Germany. Great. So uh, what message do you have to students who are on the sidelines still thinking or making up, trying to make up their minds on where to study? Well, I would advise um, anyone, if you have the contact of Eurasia Institute, just contact them because they did everything great for me. Also when it comes to the visa to come to Germany, everything worked out perfectly and with the university, everything. So I would advise people to just come. Don't be afraid to take part in the language course. It's very interesting. And also just the possibility of speaking a foreign language in just a short time. Um, it's a wonderful experience. And one very last question. What are the plans for the future? Um, well, I would like to be a university lecturer either in Nigeria or here in Germany, but for now I'm just going to some research work and um, I would also like to work after my university to get some experience and just enjoy my life. I believe you will. We wish you so much good luck and we're looking forward to welcoming you again back to your Institute. Thank you very much. <laughs>